Hello everyone, into this particular video, we will cover the important points related to the LSMW and what are those two points. Whenever participants are doing the practical for LSMW, they are getting the error in convert data file name. So firstly, we will replicate and then we will see what is the solution for the same. And on frequent basis, I'm getting the mails for the same that they are doing the practical for LSMW and they struck onto this particular step. So we'll simply go for the solution of the same. And secondly, we will cover the administration of LSMW. Whenever participants are doing the practical of LSMW, they are asking, is it possible to copy the LSMW? Is it possible to delete, rename or change the LSMW which they created because they are not able to see any options there. So all these things are possible with LSMW. So into this particular video, we will cover two important points because so many people are asking about this and I am getting frequent mails of the same. So rather than going for individual reply, now it's good that there must be some video so that everyone can resolve the issue by themselves. So firstly, we will go for first extremely important point because so many people stuck into this particular step whenever they are doing the practical of LSMW. So we'll replicate this first scenario. So what I will do, I'll simply go to LSMW transaction code. And yes, into this particular video, I will not go for detailed understanding of LSMW because anyways, it is already covered. We just replicate why we are getting the error and how we will resolve that error. Suppose I will simply click on to create entry button and we will create a project, sub project and object. Suppose my name of the project is, suppose I will write material underscore approach. Okay. Suppose I will write project for materials. I will go for okay. Now I will give some name to the sub project. Suppose material underscore sub group. Okay, is it okay? Sub project for materials. I will go for okay. Now this object name is also okay. Material underscore object. So I will write object for materials. So I provided the project, sub project and object. We'll go for continue. I will simply go to execute. I will go to change mode. We'll go for batch input recording radio button. I will go for recording. I will go for create. I will give some name to the recording. For detailed understanding on the steps, anyways, you need to follow the videos of LSMW. Into this particular video, we are just targeting why we are getting that error and how we can resolve that error. Suppose I will write MM01 record. I will give the transaction code MM01. Suppose I will give some material. Suppose I will write material underscore suppose testing. I'll go for industry sector, material type. I'll go for basic data one. I will go for description, unit of measurement. In my system, material group is compulsory external material group. In your system, it might not be mandatory. So I'm passing some value here. Weld value, I'm going for C. So whatever the things or whatever the values will pass from the file, I'll simply go for default. This is material. This is industry sector, material type. This is our material description. This is our unit of measurement. 
okay this external material group anyways it's hard coded that will not pass from the file same i'll go for back and i will choose the recording so first step done I'll define the source structure. I'll simply go for create. Suppose my name of the source structure is suppose material underscore source. Suppose I will write source structure. I'll go for okay. Second step done. I'll simply go to third step, source fields. I'll simply go for shortcut, source fields, copy fields. Copy from data repository. I'll copy from this particular structure because this structure has already these columns. If I'll show you, you can get the detailed understanding of all these steps by referring the LSMW topic in the same playlist. So this structure has five columns. We'll simply call five columns done. We'll define the relation. I'll simply go to same. So arrow is from this to this done. We'll go for field mapping and conversion rules. Auto field mapping. Those who know LSMW topic, they know very well the meaning of all these steps. Now I will go for specify files and here we will get the error. And this is the step where participants stuck and they are unable to proceed. Suppose I'll simply double click and take a file. My file is on the desktop. I'll just give the description. I will go for tabulator and into my file, there is no labels. If I will go for file, there is no label. Directly we have the data. If directly we have the data, there is no need to select this checkbox. I will go for OK. Whenever I will go for continue, I will get the error. And which participants are getting, I will just go for save and we will get the error. Whenever we are going for save, SAP is giving the error file name converted data max 45 character. Just see converted data. This name can be maximum up to 45 character. And this is the step where so many people stuck and they want that how they can proceed. Just see how SAP is creating the name of the conversion file. This is your project underscore sub project underscore object dot lsmw dot comp and this name cannot exceed 45 character so what you can do you can simply shorten the name if at the initial level we will create a project sub project and object length very small so anyway it will not exceed 45 character so it is not the case that everyone will get this error. So those who are getting this error, they can simply double click and just shorten the name. Suppose rather than material, suppose I will go for mat. Suppose rather than material, I will go for mat. If I will go for OK and check, I think it is less than 45. Then I will go for OK. So this is the way how you can resolve this particular error. It is clearly mentioning also that you can just go for maximum up to 45 characters. Now we will go for the second. So first point done. Error in convert data file name, conversion file name can only accept up to 45 characters. Now we will go for second point. Now, so many people created the LSMW. Now they want to copy. They want to delete. They want to rename. They just want to go for change. They want to just change the name of project. Suppose sub project. Suppose object. 
So how we can go for all these things? Because whenever you will go for LSMW, you will not be able to find all these things. Suppose if I will go for LSMW, here you will not be able to see any cop copy option, any rename option, any delete option. So how you can go for all these things? Simple, you need to go for go to administration. Once you go for go to administration, you will be able to see all these points. I will go for go to administration. And you can see, you will be able to see all those LSMW. I'll check my LSMW just now I created. Suppose this is R Mehta, my ID, I can find also. Suppose if I will find by my name, I can navigate to that. Suppose I can navigate, this is 10th, today's date. Now you can see, suppose this is my project, this is my sub project and this is my object. Suppose I want to rename the name of sub project. So I can rename, yes, depends upon the requirement. Suppose you gave some name and you want to rename. Suppose this is my sub project, I want to rename. So this is the option to rename. Suppose I'll simply give Mac. I'll go for OK. Suppose I want to rename the object. So I can simply go for this. I'll go for OK. I'll go for save. I'll just go. I think it's saved. Yes. If I'll go to back button, go to administration. I think there's no option to save, but it's changed. If I'll go for material underscore project, yes. It's changed. So there's no option to say, but it's automatically getting changed. Suppose if I want to go for change, this is the, this is I rename. Suppose if I want to change the description, suppose I want to change the description of project. So I'll simply put the cursor here. I'll go for change. Suppose I want to change the description. Suppose I will write material project. And this happens, yes. I'll go for OK. Now you can see description change. Suppose if I want to copy, this is our LSMWS. If I want to copy same to same LSMW, I can simply click and there's the option of copy. So I can simply give the name, suppose Matt underscore proj, suppose underscore CPY. Suppose copy. And you can see one more copy created. This is one more copy created. We have the sub project and we have the object into that. Suppose I want to delete whatever I created, whatever the copy I created, I want to delete. Suppose you can simply put the cursor, you can delete. I'll go for this. Suppose whatever I created just now, material underscore proj, this one, yes. Suppose I want to delete, so I can simply go for delete. Yeah. So this is the way how you can go for complete administration. So everything is possible. You just need to go for go to administration. So what is the summary of this particular video? In this video, I covered two important points. And this is asked by so many participants and I'm getting the frequent miss. So it's good that they can resolve the error by themselves. So I prepare, I'm preparing a video for the same. So what is the first, first, the first problem? Whenever they are creating LSMW, so in specify file step, they are getting a error that convert data file name cannot be more than 45 characters. So you can just double click and shorten the length. You can remove few characters. It will not impact anywhere. Now, next thing is it is possible to do everything with the LSMW. You can copy, you can delete, you can rename, you can simply change. You can do each and everything. Just you need to go for go to administration. Once you go to administration, you will be able to see all these features. So that's it in this video. Thank you.